guys, thank you so much for watching. Today we're gonna jump into all of the fish, bugs, and deep sea creatures you'll be able to find in Animal Crossing New Horizons in the month of March. We are, of course, only going to go over the new animals and the animals leaving after the month is over, and this is referring to the Northern Hemisphere. Before we jump in, if you do find this video helpful, do leave a like down below, and let's get into it. So let's start off with our fish, with the first one not really being a fish. The tadpole is going to be new in March. This is going to be a tiny shadow found in ponds all day long and it sells for a hundred bells. The next one's going to be the loach. This is going to have a small shadow, be found in any river across your island all day long and sells for 400 bells. The third new fish in March is going to be the cherry salmon. This is going to have a medium to small sized shadow found only from 4 p.m. to 9 a.m. and only in river cliff tops. So any river above the first floor, first layer of your island. This one's going to sell for a thousand bells. The next one being the char. This again is going to be found only in cliff top rivers. Going to have a medium to small shadow found from 4 p.m. to 9 a.m. and sells for 3,800 bells. This next one, unfortunately, I could not find. It's actually the reason this video is a day late. Uh, I have found it before, but I could not find it for a recording. This is the golden trout. This one's going to have a medium to small shadow found from 4 p.m. to 9 a.m. and only on clifftop rivers again. Be sure to save up your bait. You're going to need it. <laughs> the last new fish coming in March is going to be the Barred Knife Jaw. Hopefully I said that right. You're going to find this guy in the sea with a medium to small shadow all day long. Sells for 5,000 bells, so worth quite a bit. We do have a few fish leaving us after March is over, the first of which being the bitterling. This is going to be found in rivers with a tiny shadow all day long and sells for 900 bells. The next is going to be the yellow perch. This is going to be found again in rivers with a medium to small shadow all day long and it sells for 300 bells. The next one's going to be the string fish. Again, found only in the rivers on cliff tops, has a large shadow, found 4 p.m. to 9 a.m. and sells for 15,000 bells. This is gonna be another one that you're gonna need that fish bait for. Takes quite a while to find. The next one being the sturgeon. These guys, again, are a little bit hard to find. They're found specifically only in river mouths, so the area where your river meets the ocean. They have a huge shadow, so they're easy to spot. You can find them all day long and they sell for 10,000 bells. The next being the sea butterfly. These guys are gonna be found, of course, in the sea with a tiny shadow, found all day long and they sell for 1,000 bells. The last fish leaving after March is over is going to be the football fish. These guys are found in the sea with a medium to large shadow, found only from 4 p.m. to 9 a.m. and they sell for 2,500 bells. Moving on to our bugs, as we approach spring, we have a bunch of new bugs coming in March, the first of which being the yellow butterfly. These guys, of course, are gonna be flying, found from 4 a.m. to 7 p.m. and sell for 160 bells. You'll have no problem finding these guys. They're absolutely all over your island. Speaking of all over your island, another one that's gonna be easy to find is going to be the tiger butterfly. These guys, again, are flying, found from 4 a.m. to 7 p.m., and they sell for 240 bells. The peacock butterfly is going to be another new bug coming in March. Little bit harder to find because they specifically fly around hybrid flowers, but as long as you have hybrid flowers on your island, you'll be all good. They sell for 2,500 bells and they can be found from 4 a.m. to 7 p.m. Next, we have the mantis. These guys are gonna be found on any flower on your island from 8 a.m. to 5 p.m. and they sell for 430 bells. 
bells. The next being the orchid mantis. These guys are only found on white flowers from 8 a.m. to 5 p.m. and they sell for 2,400 bells. The next bug we have is going to be the honeybee. These guys are gonna be flying around your island just like the butterflies, found from 8 a.m. to 5 p.m. and they sell for 200 bells. Next, we have the stink bug. These guys are gonna be found on flowers all throughout your island. They can be found all day long and they sell for 120 bells. Again, you won't have any problem finding these guys. They're all over the place. The next bug being the man-faced stink bug. These guys are found on flowers from 7 p.m. to 8 a.m. They sell for a thousand bells. And then the last new bug that we have in March is going to be the ladybug. These guys are found on flowers from 8 a.m. to 5 p.m. and they sell for 200 bells. We only have one bug leaving us after March is over and that's going to be the emperor butterfly. These guys are going to be flying all over your island from 5 p.m. to 8 a.m. and they sell for 4,000 bells. They're not too hard to find but they will be one that you'll either have to jump to the evening or play in the evening to find. Moving on to our last section, we have just a few new deep sea creatures to find. First being the turban shell. This is going to be a slow moving small shadow found all throughout the day and they sell for a thousand bells. Next being the chambered nautilus. This is going to be a slow medium shadow and it's found from 4 p.m. to 9 a.m. selling for 1,800 bells. The next new deep sea creature being the umbrella octopus. These guys are a bit funny looking. They move in quick, long lunging motions and they're a small shadow. You'll know it when you see it. They're found all day long and they sell for 6,000 bells, so are a bit hard to find. Second to last being the firefly squid. These guys are really pretty when you find them because uh, they glow. They're going to be a tiny, slow moving shadow found from 9 p.m. to 4 a.m. and they sell for 1,400 bells. This one took me the longest to find and I almost gave up, but the spider crab is going to be a huge quick shadow. So trapping it alongside the edge of the netting is going to be your best bet. You can find them all day long and they sell for 12,000 bells. The only deep sea creature leaving us after March is over is going to be the Red King Crab. These guys, I was hoping they would be spider crabs and they kept being Red King Crabs. They're going to be a very fast or quick moving large shadow all day long and they sell for 8,000 bells. And that's it for our March Bug, Fish, and Deep Sea Creature Guide. Those are all the new animals either coming to the game in March or leaving after March is over for the Northern Hemisphere. If you guys enjoyed this video or did find it helpful, leaving a like down below really does help me out. I greatly do appreciate it. Hit that subscribe button if you're interested in any other Animal Crossing content or future bug and fish guides. And I will talk at you in the next video. Bye!